Hey everybody, this is Brad from Stereo Breed Media, and today I'm going to be doing a tutorial uh, that's a little bit more interesting than the last few that I put out. Um, but yeah, we're going to show you how to silhouette a person and put a video in their silhouette. Um, so if I scrub through this real quick, you can see that there's actually some show footage uh, playing in the back of his silhouette while he is rapping. Um, so yeah, we're just going to show you how to create that effect today. It's real easy, probably takes about two minutes if you shoot it right. So let's go ahead and get into it. Um, first off, in After Effects, let's go ahead and take our green screen footage and drag it into a new comp. So bang, here we go. We got just him rapping on a green screen. A really wrinkled green screen, mind you. Um, but yeah, anyhow, let's uh, go ahead and skip to a frame that is a pretty good representation of the whole entire shot. Um, we'll just highlight it. And before we actually key this out, we want to see, be able to see what we're keying. So I'm going to go to layer new solid and create a really bright blue solid. Hit OK and we'll bring that beneath the video layer. And let's go ahead to effect, go to keying and key light. Take the screen color, uh, color picker and just pick a green that represents the most, the biggest part of the green screen. So I'm going to choose about right there. Okay, so that keys a very, very good bit of it. Um, but, and now you can start to see the blue background through this video. But if we zoom in here, you can start to see some of the wrinkles and um, the shadow areas of the green screen. So we're going to want to get that out. So what we can do is actually go into the screen mat and twirl that down. And the clip black settings will just uh, pull that upwards a little bit. Now notice that if we pull it too far up, it starts to cut him out too. So you want to pull it, uh, I would suggest starting at zero and slowly pulling it up until all the wrinkles are gone. And then as soon as they're gone, stopping so it doesn't clip into him, but we still get all our wrinkles gone. So there's still a little bit in the corner. We're going to pull it up a little bit more, about right there. <clears throat> so for my footage, um, it's a clip of 36. So yeah, so now we have this uh, key. And what that means is now only he is on his own separate layer. So if we duplicate this, we can move it around. Um, yeah, so he's on his own separate layer. Anyhow, let's uh, delete that and we'll go ahead and delete our um, blue solid as well. So now we just have our key. So let's go now and bring the footage that we want to put in his silhouette and drop it beneath him on the video comp. Now this is just uh, some footage of um, them in the studio and a few shows that we shot. <clears throat> so we'll go to the show footage about right here. And all we have to do is there's a option called track mat here. And if you don't see it, there's a button down here called toggle switches and modes. You just have to click that once and you'll be able to see it. Um, but yeah, for the, uh, the actual video, I'll go ahead and name these. Uh, Video footage, green screen key. So I know those two are, uh, select the video footage layer, which is the video in the background right now. And all you have to do is change the track mat to alpha mat. Um, what this pretty much does is anything that has an alpha level um, on the layer above it shows up and anything that doesn't, doesn't. So since we have our green screen where his alpha level is keyed out to show only him and the green screen is transparent, then that's all that's picked up in the video. So uh, that's pretty much it uh, after that. So scrub through it real quick, make sure we got it. And you can use this technique for a million different things. So try some of it out yourself. Thanks for watching.